viewers and subscribers welcome back to the coach's desk with your host coach minzy and we are here to give you some update on what is happening in the world of football and in particularly the reggae boys i trust that everybody is doing okay and everybody is doing all right people 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 the merch the merch they are here I'll be dropping the link very soon. Yeah, I'll be dropping the link. Once it comes up on, on the YouTube, then definitely we'll be sharing, we'll be spreading the word for you to go and order your coaches this merch. Yeah, man, big up yourself. Thanks for the support, people. Thanks to all the persons who took the time out. You know what I mean? Uh, definitely to support the coach's desk this is where you get your sporting experience and we're happy that you definitely are on board with us big up to the panelists big up to all the persons who made this program what it is all right so i just wanted to update on on romaria campbell he has joined a club in kuwait first reggae boys or jamaican international to to, to, to play in that country. Good move for him. Well, for money maker them country there now. So, <laughs> for him, possible that's the move that he wanted. You know what I mean? And uh, another sad story is that the World Cup qualifier that is coming up against the Panama team, there won't be any, uh, from what we are hearing, spectators that are going to be allowed into the stadium. Yeah, it has it has been cut down based on the spike that is happening. So reggae boys them are gonna play with a limited amount of people. Yeah man. Probably about from what I've heard it's like about two hundred and fifty people. And um and that will include all the the, 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 the the person that should be there, like the security guards, etc., etc., etc. Yeah? So, all right. Basically, the meat of the matter, people, is to talk about coach's desk, possible 23-man squad for the game coming up against Mexico. And a matter of fact, that could also include the other three uh two games yeah so the for the first three games this is a team that i am i'm looking forward to see and this is based on what players are doing not everybody is 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 up to par right now but let's let, let's delve into it of course i think we're going with the same goalkeepers yeah so definitely Without question, Andre Blake, Dennis, uh, Dylan Barnes, sorry, and Dennis Taylor. So those three goalkeepers would fall into my 23-man squad easily. Yeah? Definitely. There's no two ways about that. So three goalkeepers will definitely fall into my squad. Yeah? All right. So we normally take it in, 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 in sequential order from the goalkeepers, defenders, midfielders forward, all right? And I'm certain if I'm going to be giving everything in order, I like that. But nevertheless, let's move on. All right, so in my defense, in my defense, definitely I'm looking for Alva Spoil, Wes Arden, Adrian Mariapa, Kimar Toxelarens, Amar Bell, who is having a, a very good showing so far at Luton Town. Yeah, man, the boss, I play some leather, man. So big up to Amar Bell. Liam Moore, who is also doing well for Reading in the championship. Damian Lowe, yeah, who is playing football. Over there in the Middle East, but I mean, we understand that there might be a move. Not certain how that will go, but um, 
Yeah, we are some big um, links in England for him. Hope uh, something will happen before the transfer window shut. If it, if not, then definitely next season. Damian Low. I mean, Damian Low is one of the 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 the, 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 the definite um, stars of this defensive unit. And you can't pick a 23-man squad without Damian Low. Ethan Pinnock also makes my list. Because trust me, Ethan Pinnock played his first game in the Premier League. English Premier League. And the man made this. The, 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 well, a selected 11 by, by Alan Shearer, former um, Newcastle stri striker. The man selected Ethan Pinnock. You know, that, that's a big feat for him to be playing in his first game. First Premier League, they dismissed Arsenal team for uh, the Brentford team, and he was very outstanding. Yeah, man, he was very outstanding. I I trust that you'll keep this form going forward. Many persons are saying that this player isn't committed and we're not gonna see him play, but I am putting putting him in this coach's desk twenty three man squad. All right, so. One other player, so I would cover. I would have covered the defense, right? So I'd say um, Alva Spowell, Wizarding, Adrian Mariapa, Kimar Toxelarens, Amar Bell, um, Liam Moore, and Damian Low, along with Ethan Pido. So they will cover the the defensive section of things. All right, in the central area of the park, definitely we're going with Kevin Stewart. He has acquired his, his, his passport for some time now. And I do believe that he will be playing in, in, in uh, a part in this um, campaign, coming up World Cup qualifiers campaign. So I'll definitely put him in the squad. Uh, we understand that he's, he's nursing a nigger right now. But nevertheless, he, 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 from what we have heard also, that it is not that serious. Yeah, So he will be ready if needs be. For the national team. So Kevin Stewart. Um, Devon Williams definitely would be in the squad. He played a, a very good um, Gold Cup campaign. Um, he was outstanding for his, his, his team again. So Devon Williams is, is, is ensuring that he keeps up his good form. He scored a double for his, 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 his USL team. And that would have allowed me to put him in back in this team. Yeah. Because he did very well given the circumstances, given the position that he played. You know what I mean? Um, i definitely go for Daniel Johnson. Yes, DJ. He played a, a very decent game for Preston as well. He scored, I believe. So, I mean, trust me, the reggae boys in UK, they are doing pretty well. And that's a good look. So, we could just now bring over this form into the national team. And it's going to be... Epic. All right, so that will cover that. And of course, Ravel signed a one-year deal with, 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 with the Rams, um, Derby County. He's doing exceptionally well as well, trust me. So definitely Ravel Morrison is going to be a part of this squad. I, 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 I can't see any reason why you will not be going to Mexico. Yeah. So those are the, 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 the persons that I would have in the... A middle of the part there and if you go up top some more i'm looking at uh um bobby reed mm -hmm. leon bailey who is doing exceptionally well in his 30 minutes for his new club aston villa trust me the boss come on and the boss turn some leather yeah People talking about him holding on to the ball along when he plays for Jamaica. I want you to watch that Aston Villa game. The man hold on to the ball, him express himself. He whipped in a wicked cross for 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 for, for, for the goal there, giving an assist for that um good play there that he, he was exhibiting. So Leon Bailey is gonna be expressing himself in England, and we definitely believe that he will continue that form over into the national team the um bobby reed outstanding weekend as well trust me bobby reed did exploit imagine three assists in a game 
Only Paul Pogba beat that with four. <laughs> yeah, man. Only Paul Pogba beat that with four. So that was a good, good bit of um, game there for, 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 for Bobby Reed. Now, I have Judah Flemings as one of the winger because, trust me, Blair Turgot, um, I wouldn't have him a part of this team. I think he's not really that outstanding to, 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 to retain his position. Judah Flemings should be able to take up that position for Blair Turgot. So I'm going to be adding Judah Flemings in, 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 in this team. Trust me. No doubt about that. Yeah? And up front... We're looking at a, 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 a Kemar roof who is on fire. Trust me. Him, him don't put a foot wrong for Rangers. Yeah? The man has been scoring since opening day. And uh, definitely, he, he, he's doing exceptionally well. We want to see this clinical striker playing for Jamaica against this Mexico team. Um, Antonio, the next man. Equal Paulo Di Canio record of 47 goals. Uh, Premier League goals for um, West Ham United. So it's a big achievement for Mikel Antonio. He scored on the weekend, gave an assist, missed a p uh, penalty, hit the crossbar. So I mean, if he continues his form going in September, trust me, Mexico, look out for Mikel Antonio. He's going to bamboozle that team and he's going to kick the ball past the goal line yeah into the back of the net so look out and a returnee definitely will be a jamal low as well because like i said the blair turgot um well i would i would basically i i i had said that um fleming would replace a a a a, a blair turgot but remember fleming was already in the gold cup team so he wouldn't be replacing him i think jamal low will be coming back in that slot where Blair Turgot is. So definitely I'm looking for these players to be a part of the team. And also, is that 23? Is that 23? Or the man, Shamar Nicholson. Yeah, man, may I go, may I go with Boza, you know? I'm going with Boza. I am going with Boza as well. Can't leave out Boza. Well, we we could because of him having a a, 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 a tournament, but he scored, missed a, a few goals as well. But definitely, I'd have him in the squad. Also, Corey Burke. You, you mean Corey Burke? Yes, I would have him in the team as well. He he did um himself proud and the country um in the Gold Cup. He was one of the outstanding players as well. So I definitely go with um, Corey Burke in that uh, slot there. So people, there you have it. What are your thoughts about this team? Critique, and as 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 our friend Richard would say, speak with your fingers in the comment section, and let me know if you think that this team that uh, is selected from the coaches desk is a good team. Yeah, it's a 20-month, 20 um, 20 uh, 23-month squad. Definitely, I want to hear your views. But let's just let me check to see if I have, have if I had all the 23. So that's Dennis Taylor, Dylan Barnes, um, Andre Blake, Juna Flemings, Alvas Powell, Wes Arden, Mariapa, Kimar Lawrence. Amari Bell, Liam Moore, um, Damian Lowe, Kevin Stewart, Devon Williams, Shamal Nicholson, Ravel Morrison, yeah? Corey Burke, Daniel Johnson, Bobby Reed, Ethan Pinnock, Bailey, which is Leon Bailey, then Kemar Roof, Antonio. And Jamal Lowe. So yes, that's my 23. People, speak in the comments below and tell me what are your thoughts on this coach's desk 23-man squad, possible 23-man squad that will take on the Mexico team. I am awaiting your comments down below in the comment section. Big up yourself. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for the support. We're out.